Didn't even know the game. PewDiePie. Today we're gonna learn how to survive everything. Everything. We're gonna be immortal and you two watching. By the end of this video, we're gonna be prepared for anything coming our way. Are you telling me we're gonna be able to survive cancel culture? <laughs> That's impossible. Get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> no, we will do that as well. We will cover yes. it all. That's good. I'll write that to the list. I have a list. <laughs> Fantastic. Wonderful. I'm always annoyed by this. I don't know why. It always annoys me when someone goes, Do you know how to be able to I'm like, no, I don't. Why? It's not gonna happen. But now I feel like I need to know. I just want to knock them all out, so I don't have to think about it ever again. And we're done. This actually started with me doing that to Marcia, because there was a we were watching this uh, K drama, and the boy was drowning in a, a frozen lake, and I was like, well, I know how to survive that. I bet you don't know how to survive that. <laughs> 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 Sweden, you gotta know how to survive. Man. Yeah, yeah, they it. teach us. They teach us. Uh, why, don't, why don't we start with that, actually? How to okay. survive falling through the ice. Okay, got this tutorial here. Yo, first of all, what would you do, Ken, if you were in ice? You got a short time to survive here. You gotta do like they do in the movies, and you gotta, you gotta push yourself under the ice and start swimming, you know, <laughs> towards, towards the edge, and like, start banging on it, and then it starts getting intense, and then you pull your gun out, and start blasting holes in it, and then you break yeah. the surface. Yeah, yeah. And the, the ice will be stiffer there, and you like start crawling out, and you, you equal your body weight across and slide That's out. That's true. You know? That's true. You gotta equal your body weight. But okay, here's the thing with this one that annoys me. It's like, oh, you need a pickaxe to like pull yourself out. <laughs> of course. I have a what do you pickaxe mean? I'm not gonna have that. Otherwise, I'm not watching this video. If like you're drowning in ice, you pull out your iPhone to be like, how to survive falling through. I'm like. <laughs> I need a, I need a pickaxe. I don't have that. And you're like, oh, thank God, I'm like a number one Minecraft bro. When you pull your trusty pickaxe out, yeah. always carry oh, with you. Why, why have a pickaxe? Why? Why didn't they think of that? Like, what is this? Of course, I'm gonna use my pickaxe. If I have it, so dumb. I hate that. This is why I hate it. This is this weird. Like, if you knew how to survive an ice. You would bring that with you, and you don't need to watch this video. True, you would have already seen the video. You would, you would know. You would know. I thought I came here to learn something. <laughs> okay. No, it's just me complaining. But it, but 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 here's where Marcia failed. And uh, if the ice is cracking, what do you do underneath you? Cracking? I mean, yeah, you, like, you gotta you gotta spread, like in the you movies, gotta spread, you gotta spread it out. You gotta starfish that mug. You know, you gotta spread it you out. You gotta starfish. Just... That's right. Yeah, you That's even right. teach you that in Minnesota, Minnesota, Mississippi. Oh, we know all about starfishes. Don't worry about that. Chocolate starfishes or delicacies. <laughs> all right. I think we know how to not how to survive a frozen ice. Yeah, we did it. We survived. Yeah. All right. Next up, elevator. You're not gonna tell me that you gotta jump right before it hits the bottom or something, are you? <laughs> all right. Well, here we go. Let's check it <laughs> out. Uh, what Try. would you do? Jump, A. Eh? Brace yourself. Brace yourself? Or C. Lie flat on the floor. I'll lay on All the right. floor. Starfish gang! Starfish is like starfish. the ultimate survival. I would starfish. jump just to see how it feels. I, I feel like I'm probably gonna die anyway, and it probably feels cool to jump. <laughs> if you chose yeah. jump, you're probably dead. <laughs> if you jump at just the right moment, as the elevator's hitting the floor, you slow down the speed of your fall, and that yeah. gives you a soft landing. Mm-hmm. But... Chances that you could make it work are slim. So there is a chance. Have you seen this? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you were designed to survive car crashes. Yeah. Apparently to survive right. car crashes, you have to have like 12 nipples. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So now we know how to also survive a car crash. I feel like this applies for the <laughs> elevator too. Like if you look like this and you're in an elevator and it's crashing down, you you don't even need to lay down you're good you can survive everything if you look like this the friend zone falling out of a plane all right we got elevator we got eyes what's next ken we gotta get attacked by an animal next right bears bears always bears. picked me off so much too because it's like oh uh okay so tell me what you need to do what you need to do ken tell me how you survive well you just yeah. gotta just gotta play dead is what they say yeah. right they say play dead and then they're like, oh, but not if it's this bear, because then they'll eat you. We'll put my trusty scout book here and figure out what kind of bear this is. We'll Google it real quick. The, this is the kind book. of video where they tell you, hey, use bear spray. No, sh I'm going to use bear spray for have it on me. The point is to <laughs> what? It's like, all right, Batman, you know, you just fell in the ice. You got your, your bat pick. The bear's attacking you. You got your, 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 bear, your bat bear spray. Bring out your bazooka and shoot the bear if you. <laughs> it's all right, 10 meters away and then spray. Oh yeah, there we go! Spray him! Cool. 
Awesome. Couldn't have figured that one out. Spray for about two seconds. Imagine having bear spray and not using it because you're too dumb to realize you need to use it. Like, come on. I don't even know if I'd be able to spray a bear if it's that close to me. Those things are huge. You'd be scared of spraying? So you're saying you would die with you would spray yourself? I mean, I feel like this is, uh, you don't have a lot of room for error here, so there's a lot of, you gotta be pretty clutch to pull this off. Oh, the bear's coming, better get my bear spray and wait until he's, you know, Yeah, but that's when you're, that, that's when me. those hyper instinct kicks in and you're like, you don't, you don't mess that up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't mess that up. Alright, so what do you need to do? I need then to know this. Come on. As fast as possible. Alright, thanks. But Run from the bear, you don't have it. bear spray? Yes! What should you do then? Yes! Step four. Choose your survival strategy. Okay, finally. If you end up on a date with a black bear, you might be relatively safe, but don't ruin the moment by climbing oh, up a so tree. Cute. Black bears Why? are much better climbers than you are. Oh, okay. Yeah, black bear, don't climb tree. Got it. But they're better climbers than us. I feel like that's a challenge. Have you ever oh, tried yeah? to climb a tree? Yeah, uh, of course. It's not easy. Like, unless there's like a low limb you can grab and pull yourself up, like like bear hugging a tree and trying to climb it that's that's a good point point. and don't try to play dead black bears don't fall for that what is this super bear you can't climb tree you can't play dead what are you gonna do instead hit the bear what? with a stick throw st <laughs> Dude, that, no i'm not gonna hit that's me you gotta challenge him you gotta throw down the gauntlet and be like you want some of this bear show him who's boss oh okay all right with grizzlies it's different you oh, don't want no. a lot from a brown bear He'll catch you and eat you before you know it. Oh, your great. Your best bet is to fall in the fetal position and protect your head, neck, and stomach. Okay, okay, I got it, Ken. Black bear, Chad. Brown bear, Beta. <laughs> right? Okay. That makes sense. I feel I feel like my brain will purposely mess me up when I'm in this. I, I, it'll just be like, was it black or was it brown? Do I antagonize the brown bear or the black bear? What was it? Pick up a rock and you're like, ah, come at me! It just mauls you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, black Chad, brown beta. Got it. Okay. All right. What's next on the survival list, Ken? What do you? What would you want to know? What else you got on the list? Well, one thing that I, I I feel like I should know because in in UK there is a lot of like wetland and swamps and bombs and. I thought he was about to say cows. <laughs> <laughs> shut up shut up that's actually good i'll write that down in case we need to look it up <laughs> survive a cow attack. how to escape quicksand oh i hear you don't even have to because you won't actually die in it what like it just doesn't work like you think it does in the movies and everything like you'll just kind of sink and just swim out of it it's basically impossible to die in the way depicted in movies Qu because quicksand is denser than the human body oh so it sinks while you float up eventually okay the answer is inconclusive if you ask me Ken, but uh yeah so ken if you're uh, sunk in into quicksand just say hey it's fine i won't die <laughs> don't worry guys i'll get out in a minute i may lose my shoes but i'll get out of here don't worry here's what are you supposed to do according to french lady with bad audio put the weight on one leg and then pull all right we need some acronym or something to so i remember it and when i mean i need acronyms the wolf Woof. Wiggle woof. your foot. Yeah. Wait, wait on one foot. Yeah, woof. You gotta woof it. <laughs> you gotta woof it. If you're in the quick stand, you gotta woof it. They should have said, you tie the rope to your pickaxe that you always have. You're, you're a <laughs> yeah. Minecraft bro. You throw it out there. You pull yourself out. So you take off your DJI drone. You make it fly really high. You throw a lasso on top of it and you pull yourself out you're welcome thanks <laughs> pull out your quicksand spray and spray that mug and then you just it hardens up <laughs> tsunami what do you do oh well i think it's like as soon as you when you when you walk outside and you notice how the water is weirdly <laughs> low hop in your car and start booking it because it's coming an early sign of an impending tsunami is that the water along the coast will recede yeah back and exposes the sea floor do not go to the beach to investigate you'll only be putting yourself at risk for when the water surges back. Instead, head in the opposite direction. <laughs> yeah, show that dude running. That's me right there. <laughs> <laughs> I just love that. In, go in the opposite way of danger. I'm like, wow, no way. So me, for those of you who don't know, me and Ken are baffled by the fact that people die from cows. 20 people die every year. How do you avoid a cow attack? First, you get rid of it. <laughs> I just my cancer culture. Here we go. Ah, yes. Always be honest. The best defense is 
always the truth. This is terrible <laughs> advice. <laughs> Off to a bad start. Don't try to cancel others. What do you mean? No, you need to throw everyone under the bus. What are you yeah, talking right. about? <laughs> survival the fittest. Deflect, deflect. <laughs> yes. All right, Ken. Now we know how to survive anything. And so do you watching. You're welcome. Smash like, subscribe. Check out Ken. See you next time. Brokefish. Edgar, what are you doing? You're browsing the internet unprotected. Oh my god. Oh, god. Bro, how many times I gotta tell you? You gotta download NordVPN. Why, why Fenrir? With NordVPN, all your internet data stays safe behind the wall of next generation encryption. Next generation. You will be the last generation. Sorry. What about logs? There's a strict no logs policy. They don't track collect anything. Don't worry. With NordVPN, you will be safe. Be afraid, child. Get access to the actual World Wide Web. Hundreds of streaming services worldwide. Bam, I'm in Japan watching anime. Boom, I'm in India watching... Watching everything except lasagna. <laughs> you can use it on multiple devices as well. You can use it on your phone, on your computer. It's easy as a one clickety clack. And they let you connect up to six devices. Edgar has gotten tired now. Right, time to wrap up. If you go to nordvpn.com slash PewDiePie with the link in the description, you get a huge bonus. So take advantage of that because you also get an additional month for free. So use the link in the description while you sign up to take advantage. For me, a VPN is a must when I'm doing banking on another Wi-Fi network. Or if I want to sh watch shows from different countries. It's always there and it's super easy to use. So I recommend it. nordvpn.com slash PewDiePie. Use the link. Thank you for sponsoring this video. Let's get on with it.